Hi Eastlink, uh, my name is Nicole and I am applying for the host of your food show this summer. My apologies, I'm actually late in my application but I have absolute good reason because I was on a five day tour of the Maritimes with students and we were traveling around and getting the taste of the Maritimes. So for example, I was in Charlottetown at the Dublin Inn and we had a chance to have real Malpac oysters and they were phenomenal and then we moved on to, uh, we were in St. Andrews, New Brunswick, and we had haddock right off the wharf, and it was unbelievable. It was this big. And then we had a chance to go on to Digby, and we had Digby scallops, and we actually had a great time. So my apologies for being late, but the food took up my time, as I hope that this show would do as well. So the question that you asked was to talk about my favorite restaurant. So I thought about it for a day or two, and I realized I don't have an answer. And I think that's because I don't have a favorite restaurant, I have a favorite breakfast restaurant, or I have a favorite family pub restaurant, or a coffee shop that I have my friends and family at, or the nice fine dining place where you'd like to go for a first date. So I think every restaurant holds something really beautiful about it, but I don't think that there's one that I would say is my favorite. But about the show, I think why I would love to be part of it is because when I think about my life, I, you know, I regard myself as a foodie, and you hear that you know, that name before, but I think that when you talk about food, what interests me is going into restaurants and finding out why the chef decided that that's a menu item. Is it because it's a family tradition? Is it, you know, something that's been passed down for generations? Is it cultural? You know, where did he source his ingredients from? Is it the favorite thing on the item? And then look around the restaurant and find out what relationships are being built. Are, are tables conversing with each other? Um, are they quiet and they're so intent on their conversation or is it all about the food and wine pairing and there's such interesting stuff in conversations around that food. That's why I want to be part of it. Last why I want to be part of it is because this is what I do. I'm lucky enough to be a teacher who teaches tourism and part of that is food and beverage. Hence I was taking my students on this trip. So I have a summer off. I have two months that you need to do this. So choose me. Thanks for taking the time to listen. Cheers.